you piece of Oh. You little rat. Hello. And you should be careful before opening your mouth and go to my boyfriend, not minding your own How was it? It was good. And what time did you come back? I can't remember. I can't remember. We were the last out of the club, put it that way. What's wrong, right? You've... I don't understand your behaviour since the conversation we had. You're arguing with me over me going out with the guys. I said I was going to. I said Sam invited me. Excuse me, it's not the night out with the boys. It is a night out with Sam Prince organising. Suddenly, I got scared and worried and I have doubts of our future. It's, it's just too much right now. And you know what? Yeah, you won't like what, what Sam said, but... He was saying, oh, James, you know what? I think that you'll make the biggest mistake of your life if you marry Mabel right now. What? That's what he said. He said that. He said you're making the big mistake you of your life. Will, you will make the biggest mistake of your life. Yeah, yeah, I understand that. that. I'm just repeating what you just said. Yeah, and I'm putting it into context. And I told him... Uh, why? And I told him, because he doesn't think I'm it ready right now. He thinks I'm that? young. He thinks I'm young. He thinks that I'm not ready for it. And he knew me before I was with you. But Ooh. don't worry, I'm going to talk to him. Brilliant. Don't worry, he's going to hear from me. I don't know what to say anymore, Mabel. I don't know what to say. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hello. I've been summoned. Here we are. I wanted to talk to you. Okay. Because I have a few questions, mm. and I think it's going to be pretty straightforward. Okay. I want to understand what are you trying to do? I just want to hang out with your boyfriend. Okay. All right. And I would like to, uh, I'd like to go on more nights out with him. I think he wants to go on more nights out too. I know your past with James when you used to hang out and have fun and everything. And I saw that James last night. And yeah, because James, when he's got a few drinks, he likes to have fun. He's wild, right? And he's amazing. Amazing. It's normal. My favorite. Of course. One thing, one thing which baffles me is the fact that I don't understand why I'm getting summoned here to talk to you when I've done nothing wrong but gone a night out with your boyfriend. Is it insecure that he's going out? Uh, no. What no, is it? Absolutely not. Um, my problem is not James. I don't have a problem with James it's right now. It's, it's you. Because you're a bad influence. Yeah. You think you're allowed to say things to him, like, for example, um, you would make a huge mistake, James, if you get married with Maeva right now, for example. I think it'd be a huge mistake getting married right now. Why? Because he's 26 years old, but I think he lives a very much married with kids' life. Yeah. I think you need because to accept you know my me? opinion. You know as my his life? Friend. As his friend. Because you think you're his friend. So you control his life and his friends. I know. I don't control. You're basically you're like his mum. Because you know me, right? You know me. Yeah. Do you? I, I, I don't know Do you. you know but me? judging from this performance, yeah. yeah so it's, uh... the fact that you don't know me, you just said it. You said to my boyfriend, you shouldn't it's marry Mabel. It's not about you. And it's you don't just... know me. Why do you open your mouth? Don't just Stick your nose in my business. Well, I have. Clearly. Don't think I that think stop me and it. James, we don't trust each other or we have an oh, issue. Not. It's why? been three years we're together. Why? We're why? fine. Why are you so upset? We are fine. Are I'm so upset, upset because you're putting your mouth. Well. You do not do that. And you don't put this <laughs> smile on your face, you piece of Oh. You little rat. Hello. And you should be careful before opening your mouth and go to my boyfriend, not minding your and say to him, do not marry this girl. You stick your nose again, you piece